Let's write an equation of the line that goes through this point and has this slope. Now notice, you can use the point-slope form because you're given a point and you're given a slope, but we're given a particular point. Did you notice that this point happens to be the y-intercept? If you notice that this happens to be the y-intercept, you can use this form, y is equal to mx plus b. Now we're only able to use this form because this happens to be the y-intercept that we were given. So let's use this form, the slope-intercept form. So that will be y is equal to, we're given the slope is 5x, and then we're given the y value of the y-intercept, and that is negative 2. Now we want to write this in standard form. I will subtract 5x from both sides, so I'll have negative 5x plus this y is equal to, and if I subtract 5x from this side, I'm left with negative 2. Now here is my equation in standard form. You may see it written like this. You may also see it written in another format. Let's multiply through by negative 1. This times negative 1 is 5x. This times negative 1 minus y. And this times negative 1 is equal to 2. Multiplying through by negative 1 does produce an equivalent equation, so these two are equivalent. They're both in standard form. They're both perfectly okay. I just wanted to make that point here. Either one of these is okay. It is in standard form. Both of these go through this point and have this slope.